This is where the fast-moving ribbon of air is normally over a winter. It steers the cloud and the snow and allows the colder air to come down from the north. But this winter, it's been very different. The jet stream has been pushed further north. It's taken the snow further north, and it's allowed us to draw in the milder air from the south. Now, here at home, it's another one of those uh, cold days. We've got a scattering of uh, showers around as well, but there is some sunshine here and there. And with a bit of luck, we should start to see a bit more sunshine this afternoon. That's because the thicker cloud is moving south. It's allowing more broken cloud to follow from the north. So we're seeing an improvement certainly across Northern Ireland after a cloudy morning. We've got the sunshine following on during this afternoon. The best of the sunshine probably going to be in Scotland. Lovely day here. Still some cloud and one or two showers just brushing the east coast and into the borders. Those will decay eventually. We should see fewer showers later in the far north of England, but across Yorkshire, Lincolnshire, into the Midlands, East Anglia and the southeast of England. Quite a bit of cloud and some more of those showers. They're mostly light, they're mostly of rain. There could be a little bit of sleet and snow in there from time to time, especially over the hills. Further west, though, there's a good chance of staying dry for the rest of today. And more sunshine, I think, across Cornwall and Devon in particular. A dry for most of Wales with the sunnier skies again out towards the west. So that's a look at this afternoon. Through this evening and overnight, what we find is that the showers do actually slowly die away. Some sleet and snow for a while in Kent. Cloud breaking, thinning, temperatures dropping, a widespread frost with these sort of numbers there could well be some icy patches almost anywhere and some patchy fog actually forming in Northern Ireland. For the weekend, it is staying cold for all of us. There will be some sunshine around. There will also be a few showers too. It could be a, a while before the fog lifts from Northern Ireland, but turning sunny here. Sunny in much of Scotland, away from the north. Lovely day developing in Wales and the western side of England. But again, it's the east of England that will see more cloud and we'll see those showers just breaking out through the day. Some of them wintry. A top temperature around about five degrees or so. Pretty good weather if you're heading to Cardiff, though, for the Six Nations rugby. Sunshine here, very much colder, though, across the way in Paris. Temperatures really struggling, a lot of cloud. Just on the edge of this area of high pressure that's dominating our weather for the moment, dry in the Alps and the Pyrenees. There is some wet weather coming through the Mediterranean, and that is going to be heading right for Rome. So on Sunday for the game between Italy and England, it's going to be a soggy forward battle. Full coverage, of course, across the BBC. Back home on Sunday, similar sort of day. Again, we've got a few showers for central and eastern England, some sunshine. The later in the day, we'll see some rain arriving in the northwest of Scotland and also for Northern Ireland. There you go.